Alright guys, Diecast Mania here with another video, and today we're going to be taking a look at the second member scrap shear for 35 ton excavators in 1 50th scale made by Buffalo Construction Models on Shapeways. Now this particular unit is in the white, strong, and flexible material, which is selectively laser-centered um, 3D printed material, but anyway, it comes in two separate bags from Shapeways, and the first thing you're going to do when you receive the item is you're going to inspect the pieces and that they are all included. So you will have the connecting pin, the main blade of the shear itself, a top piece or mount for the shear, and the two components to produce the hydraulic cylinder for the shear. For the shear itself, the assembly is going to be somewhat straightforward and you're going to need to use some small metal wire or pins, such as brass rod or even paper clips, and a little bit of uh, tinkering to get them to fit perfectly. Now here's the shear completely assembled. It is a fairly straightforward piece to assemble with a little bit of fine adjustment here and there which is to be expected with 3D printed products. About the only other thing you will need to assemble this shear that is not included is some fine brass rod which in this case I use 0.032 or 0.81 millimeter brass. So picking up the shear we can see that it is fairly detailed. It is a pretty solid feeling piece which will allow you to work the various functions such as the opening and closing of the jaw mechanism and the rotation in a full 360 degrees without really worrying about it breaking too easily. Now let's get the shear mounted up on a 35 ton excavator. As you can see the shear can rotate 360 degrees follows the full range of movement as a normal stick would and as we can see, the cutting edge opens up this far and goes in this far to a full closed position. So the range of motion is pretty decent on this, as we can see. Now I'll go ahead and show you some of the details real close up. So with an up close look, we can see some of the detail on the shear, such as the bolt and cutting edge detail and just the general shape of the shear is captured very very nicely. Now regardless of whatever material you choose from Shapeways, the shear will still have all the fine details just like this, which is really a nice touch. Alright, I'll conclude this review with my final impressions or real honest opinions on this shear. Now for those of you out there watching, you'll probably have this one question, is it worth the money? In my mind, absolutely. Shears or attachments in general are a really expensive uh, business and this is perhaps one of the most accessible and affordable options out there. It offers a high degree of customization, you can finish it however you like and attach it to most 35 ton or so uh, hydraulic excavator models. Some of the plus points to this model would be the fairly straightforward assembly process and the decently solid feel to it. So all of this makes the attachment a real worthwhile addition to any uh, model collection. So if you like what you see, the link to purchase will be down in the description. The creator this year has also offered a 20 ton demolition grapple, so if you're into that sort of thing, you might as well check that out as well. So anyway, there you go guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this review.